We're checking out the Chevy Tahoe command vehicle for the Ramsey, New Jersey Fire Department. Enforce NXT light bar up top. Blueprint electrical control system. Weston push bumper, four M powers in the front, one per side. Hella Heroes in the turn signal replacement, giving them red and blue flashing. Graphics package to match all of their existing vehicles that we have for them. Under mirror M powers, SL runners Frenched into the running board. Four inch M power in the rear side window. Eight mod M power spoiler. Four by twos on the rear plate. Hello Heroes on the turn signal. Parking lights flashing with the control system, synchronized with all the other lights. M powers on the rear bumper. With our hatch open, you can see that we shut off our warning lights up top so that they're not shining up top. Four inch M powers on the rear hatch lip. Six by three sound off scene lights. Got our speakers recessed into our headliner, giving them nice sound projection, easily serviceable with our mounting bracket. Got our gear slide out that has all their extra parts. Full slide out, 600 pound drawer slide rating. Radio faceplate, which is shortened up to allow for mounting of equipment like we have here. So you have flashlight, thermal imaging charger, flashlight. They've got their Knox box pre-wired. And we've got two other drawers. Top one's just gonna be a shallow parts drawer. One below that, ratcheting magnetic command board. Looking at the back of the cabinet, we've got a replacement floor with all of our electronics mounted underneath. We've got our pack tool mounts for your irons. And then you can see we have a cabin heater. So when the truck's plugged in, it'll run the heater to help keep the edge off of your gear when you're in the car when it's snowing out. Overhead Troy console with their uh, radio faceplate mounted up there. We've got our radio speakers mounted to our headliner with our special bracket that allows them to be serviced. Same as the back. Three more radio heads down here. We've got our blooper control system, our cup holder with our cell phone pocket, a small binder storage, and then our portable chargers recessed into the faceplate. So drive response mode changes our pattern automatically through the link module adding white flashing, more aggressive pattern, adding our headlight flasher, all programmable and changeable through the blueprint system, giving them the ability to make flexible changes as they need. Thanks for checking out this week's build showcase. If you have any questions about this vehicle or one built better to suit your needs, please feel free to reach out to us.